Like say, I went to do Ikkyo, started to work and he pulled his hand back. Whatever happened then, I didn't get hit. Bang, now I've got the first shot. Right? To me, that's success. Some other person might say, oh, Ikkyo doesn't work. It's like, well, if you've got no heart, sure, it didn't work. But it's not like, <laughs> I'm, I'm, you know, he gives up. You know, if he's going to give up that easy, you probably don't have a problem in the first place. Or say I went to do Senkyo. I've got Senkyo, I don't know, he spun out, he managed to do something. He didn't hurt me there, and I'm going to get first, first go at it. And I can also use any failed attempt, right, as the beginning of a new attempt. And no technique is sacrosanct. If I try to do a technique that relies on him coming forward, and he goes backwards, well, I have to do one that goes backwards. If he just runs and disengages, 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 I'm not going to chase after him. Like, I don't need to. Like, if he wants to run away, run away. Sure. Uh, but that's the thing, like, and that's why in competitions, like you get penalised for what's called stalling. If I go pro and he's running, sticking his ass out and running backwards, there are things I can do, but it's not worth doing them. Like, and it's really getting the striking range here. You're backing out, backing out, backing out, bang, you know. Boom. I'm not going to chase and try to grapple it. Although I could.